Hello everyone. Now we will start online Japanese culture lesson 6. This lesson's topic is haiku. I will introduce a few words related to haiku. Have you ever written a poem? Also, have you ever read a poem? Do you know haiku? Haiku, haiku. Haiku is a type of short form poetry originally from Japan. It consists of three short sentences of 5, 7, 5, total 17 syllables, using seasonal words. It is said to be the shortest poem in the world. I will explain Kigo, the seasonal words, later. Now, I will introduce Kigo a word or phrase associated with a particular season. Kigo, kigo. Kigo are words that describe a certain time of the year. Seasonal haiku words classified according to the lunar calendar, which is about one month behind the solar calendar. So, you may see some expressions that are difficult to capture in the modern sense. According to the lunar calendar, spring is from January to March, summer is from April to June, autumn from July to September, winter from October to December. Here are some commonly used seasonal words. Spring, haru kaze, spring breeze, hachi, bi, fusha, windmills, fusen, balloon, etc. Summer, natsu no hoshi, summer stars, ase, sweat, kingyo, goldfish, ichigo, strawberry, etc. Autumn, aki no yoru, autumn nights, tsuki, moon, shika, deer, tanabata, tanabata festival, etc. Winter, fuyu no kumo, winter clouds, Kuma, beer. Yuki, snow. Kori, ice. Mochi, rice cake, etc. Now, I will introduce the concept of 575 in relation to haiku. 575 is a set of sounds from 5 hiragana, 7 hiragana, and 5 hiragana. Small 2 and n and long sounds, extended sound, are also considered one sound. Sounds with a small ya, yu, yo, such as cha and q, are considered one syllable with two hiragana symbols. These 17 sounds are used to describe what you see and what you feel. Now, let's read the haiku together. Furu ike ya, kawazu tobikomu, mizu no oto. The ancient pond, a frog leaps in, the sound of the water. Let's read it again in rhythm. Furu ike ya, kawazu tobikomu, mizu no oto. Let's count hiragana. The number of hiragana in furu ike ya is five. In kawazu tobikomu is 7. In mizu no oto is 5. The word kawazu here means frog. So everyone, what season word do you think kawazu is? Kawazu is the seasonal word for spring. What image comes to your mind when you read this haiku? Let's read the another haiku. Yuki tokete mura ippai no kodomo kana. The snow thaws in town, there are many kids. Let's read it again in rhythm. Yuki tokete mura ippai no kodomo kana. Let's count hiragana. The number of hiragana in yuki tokete is five. In mura ippai no is seven. In kodomo kana is five. 
What is the seasonal word in this haiku and what's the season? The word of the season for this haiku is yuki tokete, melting snow. The snow is melting, so it's a seasonal word for spring, not winter. What images come to your mind when you read this haiku? And now let's try to write a haiku. Let's briefly look at seasonal words here. Sakura, cherry blossom, is a seasonal word for spring. Kaki, persimmon, is a seasonal word for autumn. Hanabi, fireworks, is a for summer. Ochiba, fallen leaves, is for winter. Please use these seasonal words in your haiku and write the comments in our Talk in Japan channel. Let's write your haiku in the comments. Here is the summary for this lesson. Let's read often used words together again. Haiku, kigo, go shichi go, furu ikeya, kawazu, tobikomu, mizu no oto, yuki tokete, mura ippai no kodomo kana. That's all for today's lesson. Thank you very much.